Sit in position. My name is Agnes Nyamasiatomi. I'm a medical doctor, surgical pathologist. My name is Mahota Jeneja. I am an infant here under the cadets for the Sierra um, Armed Forces. When they talk about army, it needs professionals to be inside because the army cannot go along without the medical doctors. Especially in Sierra Leone, we don't have surgical pathologists. So I thought of it um, with my career. If I come to the army, I'll create a great impact into the army. I've always had this passion, this burning desire to serve my country. I know it sounds cliche, but it's true. And I saw the army as the best way to do that. And when I heard about the all-female recruitment, I saw it as my opportunity to make my dreams come true. So here I am. As a woman, uh, thinking for me to be in the army, I, it's very simple because what a man can do, a woman can do as well. And also I think this particular set of female recruiting is going to encourage more women out there for them to, to be encouraged to join the army. It's been hard. It's been really, really hard, but it's been hard in a good way because it has helped me as a person reach limits that I never thought I could reach. For example, I never thought I could fire a weapon. I never thought I could wake up at 3 a.m. and have an amazing day. I never thought I could take exams under the sun and pass. <laughs> but the army has helped build me towards that and I'm doing it. And I know it will help shape me to do more. The army has shaped me into a good person. Now I can do certain things that I haven't been doing before, which I'm so pleased about. So I think it makes no difference really. Um, being a woman, being a man, all the army tells you to do is give your blood, put in more work, put in the effort, that's all it takes. And if a man can give their blood, if a man can put in the work, why can't I? Because I'm a woman. I mean, I don't think it makes a difference.